All right. Let's get it going. <laughs> okay. Here we go. It's loading up. Here we go. We got Medina in the cut. <laughs> Who else we got? What's good? We got Newport 321. We got Successful Thinking. We got... Who else? <laughs> uh, we got Jackson. Uh, Donovan Jackson. We got G. We got so many people. We got Danny Boy 3. We got The Real CY. TYY 147. Yeah. Woo! Sorry if that was super loud. Nice. This is a nice beat, right? Alright, we're gonna get started in a few seconds here. I'm back! You thought it was over. <laughs> But it's just beginning. It isn't over. It isn't over. What are we learning today, man? Get get ready. Get ready. We're talking about how to turn website visitors into p customers that pay you money for what you are doing. Okay? So... Uh, let me just make sure people are, are seeing this. Let's see. Can I retweet my own tweet? I think I just did. Whoop. Uh, join now. Everybody share the stream. All that good jazz. And let's get into it without further ado. All right, everyone. Let go. What is up? Your boy John back in the cut after a minute of not being here. Um, no, it's been a while. The hair is even longer. Um, and things are going good. So I know I used to do all of, uh, I used to stream a lot and talk about different marketing topics. And you guys liked that. And that was good. Um, so I'm going to get back to that. Every Friday, I'll be doing a webinar. I'll probably host it on another platform as well, like something like, you know, Citrix would go to meeting or uh, Zoom or something, as well as Periscope, and maybe do something special for the people who hop on to the other platform, but also have you guys on as well. So, uh, today's topic, uh, which is a pretty good one, a lot of people asking about this, a lot of people want to learn how to do this, um, how to turn uh, website visitors into customers. So to kind of kick things off, let's uh, look at what you actually do to get people on the site and how, how that all looks. So visualize it, right? It's real simple. Um, let's turn around to the handy dandy whiteboard. All right, there we go. Uh, marker, all right, light, let's do light. Let's do that. All right, everyone. Welcome. What's up? How's everyone doing? What's uh, do I have an e-commerce site? No, I have a uh, B2B site. You can check it out, usegrowthjuice.com. I'll go ahead and actually link to that site, uh, which is a site that I've been testing with um, here. Hopefully you can... Oh, it's a, it's a shitty E. All right, whatever, we'll, we'll go with it. Use growth. Juice.com. All right. Can we see that? Uh, it's pretty crappy, isn't it? But anyways, you can check this out. This is a nice example. Well, it's my, it's my, uh, it's my side project. So uh, it's a good example for you to kind of base your site off of. Super simple, but super, uh, but but good. It's very simple, but good. Man, we're getting hearts. Tap those hearts. Share that stuff. Uh, do I make bank? I'm getting there, son. I'm getting there. Okay, so, um, all right. Real simply put, real simply put, this is a funnel, right? You take people from visitors to customers. Pretty simple, right? Um, so we got all these peeps up here. You know what I mean? 
at the very top, all right? Uh, they're an impression. Well, first of all, here's, here's the first thing. Uh, so visitor is down here. That's the second. Can you guys see that? I need that closer. Is that better? You can see that? Cool. Okay. Let me know. Thumbs up or thumbs down or yes or no. If you can see it or not. Can we? I misspelled visitors. Fuck. Oh, I suck. <laughs> okay, that means you could see it. So anyways, um, first off, it's an impression, right? So an impression can be come, come from anywhere. So it could be from, uh, you know, let's see. Can you see over here? Yeah, we'll do it over here. So Twitter, you know, a lot of people come in from my Twitter. Instagram, Snapchat, right? These all bring people into your funnel. So you're getting visitors. So right now, these right here are impressions. Fuck, did I spell that right? Does impression have two S's? I can't remember. Anyway, so they're impressions and then they are visitors. So someone goes on your Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, whatever, you shout out your website, and then they go to become a visitor. And that's what we're talking about today is how to get from visitor to paying customer. Money comes out the bottom, baby. Oh yeah. Um, so, do I like art? I do like art. Um, so, visitor. Now that we have a visitor, how are we supposed to get them, uh, I'm 20, into the customer pile right here? Um, so we need to get them in the funnel. This is the funnel. It's just a visual representation. You basically just bring them down um, these different rungs uh, and move them closer and closer towards uh, money. Now there's a, a plethora of ways you, you can do this, but basically what you want to do is uh, capture their information in some sort of fashion and they'll become a lead, right? Um, and then once they are a lead, deliver them with more information uh, or maybe get them into a trial or something and then eventually they'll become a customer. So let me talk about a, a an example funnel, right? Let's say we have um, some software. Um, so they become a visitor and then you hit them with a pop-up. And you say, hey, Bob, um, here's this free ebook if you give me your email or enter your email for a chance to win an iPad or something. Bob's like, okay, sweet, I want to win an iPad. So then he becomes an email lead. We got Bob's email. Thanks, Bob. Email lead, okay? So now that Bob is an email lead, um, he's now in our email list and we start delivering content to Bob. So here's. Um, what kind of software do we want? We want marketing software. How about that? Um, so we keep delivering uh, valuable content to Bob. We know he's into marketing. Uh, we know that kind of stuff. Most people ignore those because they likely won't win. Um, it could be anything. Again, there's a million ways to do it. It could be free ebook. It could be free consultation. You could go, you know, real. It could be, you know, gift card. It could be you could give the gift card or do a chance. Not 100% of people are going to convert. If you get 5% of people converting, then that'll be great. Yo, freak, dog. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, keep hitting those likes, everyone. Keep hitting them uh, and hit those shares. Share them out to all your peeps. Uh, you feel like those are spam to get your email. Hey, up to you again. Uh, you know, some people, you know, if you get 5%, again, 5% of people, it sounds like nothing, but it's actually a whole lot. Uh, that's a decent conversion rate. Um, if you get 5% of people converting, that's good. Uh, so yeah, keep that in mind. Anyways, so now we got Bob as an email lead. We're delivering Bob content, okay? So now Bob is getting our content. Uh, now we want to hook Bob uh, into, into getting things started. So what's the next step we could do? Free trial. Free, man, a lot of people are hitting that heart button. I, I dig it. Um, so now we get Bob into the free trial, right? So now Bob uh, is going on the software. Uh, he is playing around with it. He's getting some value, even more value out of it. Um, 
free trial without putting in your credit card. It could be, okay, so here's here's the play that you're gonna come with with that, right? So if you do without the credit card, then you're gonna have more leads, okay? If you have uh, with the credit card, you have to have a credit card for the free trial, then you're gonna have a higher conversion rate from free trial to credit card. What you should do is you should you should A-B test it actually. Use something, we're gonna get to this, but uh, use a tool called Lead, uh, uh, Instapage rather. Um, use a tool called Instapage, you can easily run A-B tests and figure out whether the credit card without it, either no credit card or credit card gets you more conversions. That's all that matters is more dollars in the bank. Um, so run an A-B test, see if that works. So now we got free trial. Bob is killing it. He's playing around with the tool. Um, and then, you know, you could, you could do, uh, even, even more things. You could give Bob a direct contact. So now we give Bob a, you know, a call. Okay. We look straight up. We have his number now, maybe because he had to put that in for the free trial. That could have been part of it. Now we say, Hey Bob, how's the trial? <clears throat> how's the trial going? Uh, how are you doing? And he says, you know what? Uh, actually, since you called, you know, blah, blah, blah. Here's the problems I had. You answered my questions and Bob becomes a customer. Okay. So this is an example funnel right here. First, Bob was an impression from Twitter. He just clicked on your website. and was like, oh, this is valuable. This is something interesting. Um, then he was a visitor, right? So he goes from Twitter impression, Twitter link clicker to visitor. Now he's scrolling around. Oh yeah, I want to win a free iPad or, you know, ebook. Let's do ebook. You guys didn't like the iPad thing, so let's do ebook. Um, you know, how, how to, how to grow your Twitter following since he came from Twitter, pretty relevant. Um, got the ebook. He was an email lead. He got some valuable content. And then in one of the emails, they asked him to sign up for a free trial. Why not? I've been getting value out of this anyways. Then after becoming uh, a free trial member, we got Bob's cell phone number and we actually gave him a freaking call and was like, Bob, you've been killing it, man. Uh, thanks for signing up. You know what? Let's just get you as a customer. It's almost the end of your trial. And he's like, you know what? You know, maybe I had some issues, but you know, you called me and we resolved it. And you know what? Customer cash money, son. So that's a very simple, um, funnel right there. And again, you can do this any which number of ways you can do. You can have no funnel. It could just be, well, the funnel would be impression to customer. It could just be like, Hey, pay for my stuff. Uh, my funnel right now is you go to my site and you get a free trial and then after the free trial i will send you some results i'll call you we'll have a conversation uh and then i'll convert you into a customer so let's look at some of the questions uh all right so you sell clothes and art so visitors uh either buy or they don't exactly so here's how we'll get into e-commerce because i saw a couple questions about that so how do you if you're e-commerce and maybe not b2b model um get into that right well, basically what you would do um, is you could do something similar here. You could still capture their email, right? You can still say like, hey, um, you could do something like, hey, enter your email for 10% off site-wide. Site-wide coupon, we'll email it to you. Um, that's a great, and then you can remarket to them and you know promote more product, hopefully give them some value as well, um, but you know promote more products to them. Say like, hey, uh, check these different things out, etc. Uh, so basically, provide some free shit so they can get a taste of uh, real customer, right? Potentially, it could be just some valuable content. So if you're if you're doing art, okay, um, you could create some valuable content. So you could create some literally some how-to videos on how to do uh, you know watercolor or whatever art it is uh, that you're doing. So you could say, hey, sign up here for my free uh, you know video course on uh, watercolor. And someone's like, oh, that's pretty sick, actually. I'd like to learn how to do that. Um, and then you hit them with uh, seven days of emails. You know, day one, here's uh, here's how to you know pick your paints. Here's how to pick your brushes. Day two, you know, you get the idea for seven days. Um, and then you, you could even just sell the products right there in the freaking videos. Here's, here's the paints I would buy. Hey, buy them on the site. You see what I'm saying? Um, you don't make the, or you just sell it. Sure. Okay. So, uh, in that, in that case, it could be, uh, picking art, how to, um, you know, decorate your room with sick art, how to, you know, cause you're picking the art obviously, um, for some reason or another. 
you know, how to buy your girlfriend uh, a cool piece of art, how to, you know, see what I'm saying? So there's, there's, there's many ways which, in which you can do it. Uh, it's basically just applying the template here into what you're doing, customizing it, tweaking it, uh, maybe adding in, you know, more or less, or less stages. Um, and then eventually, you know, you should be getting more customers uh, than you were before. So, yeah, again, in your in your example, you know, think of some cool how to videos are are a good a good way to do it. Or it could just be like, uh, you know, sick art show. Or it could just be like art hall. Like here's here's all the newest pieces this week. You know, uh, week of what's this week? Uh, you know, April week of April first or April third, I guess is next week. April third, new art hall. Um, that kind of thing. Um, so yeah, that's the basic idea uh, behind that. Now we can go into my site, uh, again, usegrowthjuice.com, uh, which by the way, y'all should sign up for because one thing I didn't address is how, okay, how do we get a visitor in the first place? Well, growth juice is a really sick tool with which you can grow your social media following automatically. I use it on my Twitter here. Let me switch my camera around. I know it's going to go for a second. I use growth juice on my site here. Uh, oops, meeting. Sorry, that's my that's my other software. Um, and you can get you know forty three thousand followers. Not bad. Um, so, anyways, let's go to my site. Growth juice. I'm about to run out of power here. Use growth juice. Bam. So. Here's an example of my site. Um, what I did was a very what's what's called a lead page, a very simple lead page. I have an uh, you know the product, what it is, very simple. It grows your following while you sleep, uh, and you get a free seven day demo, and then you just fill out the form here, and that's about it. So uh, again, this is super super simple um, lead form. And I use this lead form uh, to then get the trial started, and then I can contact them uh, any number of ways and kind of answer any questions, be a point of help. Um, I do a little bit of explaining here, so it's like, okay, why is it valuable? Actually, I should put why is it valuable on here. You get leads, you build your brand, and you grow other channels because you can promote uh, obviously other things and I have myself <laughs> as a testimonial gonna be throwing some new testimonials up there soon uh, but yeah so anyways this is my site as an example um, and we'll actually go through um, my actual insta page and I can show you how I built it Hopefully still going. How's it going, everyone? Um, feel free to hit the share. I think it's swipe to the left or swipe to the right and share that shit. So that way other people can join you um, and we can see how to better build websites to get more customers. Always a good thing. By the way, did you sign up for Use Growth Juice yet? It is use usegrowthjuice.com. Usegrowthjuice.com. Check it out if you haven't already. <laughs> Bam. All right, so we're getting logged into uh, Instapage. So Instapage is really cool. It's basically a drag and drop lead page or other, ba you, can, you can do anything with it. You can do e-commerce as well. Um, what I do is I use it. Whoa, I got a bunch of new leads. And I didn't even know. That must have been from you guys. Um, so I really like Instapage because you can you can very easily quickly build up um, a uh, easily build up and throw up a page a landing page um, as well as collect leads which is great for you know B two B businesses and whatnot. I'll kind of flip the camera. So as you can see, I got five new five new leads waiting for me right now, which is great. Um, and we'll hop into how it's built. It's pretty simple. So they have any a bunch of templates. You just pick from the template. 
once it loads. And then just throw up. I mean, you can throw up. And then uh, put all your info on there. I got my logo. I have a super short, crisp explanation. Hopefully it's crisp uh, explanation of what's going on. I have the, you know, three button uh, form layout here. It's real simple, guys. Um, I can edit all this text. Uh, this testimonial template came in as part of the template. Um, and you can really easily run A-B tests. You just hit create A-B tests, and then you add some variables. I could change the color of this background. I could change the color of these buttons. I could change my logo. I could change, there's so many things I could change, and A-B testing is really important because then you test and test and test, and you learn um, how to better increase your conversion rate. I haven't even run an A-B test because I've been so bogged down with getting the whole system set up, but, That's the general idea. Again, use the funnel, add some value, um, and if you haven't signed up for usegrowthjuice.com yet, uh, you'll get a few thousand followers a month. It's pretty slick. Again, I have 43,000, um, as you can see if you you know go to my Twitter. Um, and yeah, that's about it, guys. Uh, cool. Thanks so much for sticking around, and I will see you next Friday. Adios.